thought I'd shoot a quick video here uh, fueling up right now these swing machines uh, all of them the 2154 the 2954 the 3754 and the uh, 2454 they all have the same uh, back end fuel tank and everything on them each one of them holds uh, 268 gallons of diesel fuel and it's this whole back end back here it's a plastic tank uh, in it but the tank is sitting on top this this whole back piece down there just under the John Deere sticker right down below it from there down is concrete in this back end and the reason why I know that is is because I've had this fuel tank out of this thing when we first got it it had a whole pinhole in the fuel tank and so they had to replace the fuel tank so that's how I know it's got concrete and the fuel tanks plastic but the cool thing about it is I can run over a week uh, like this tank here I ran 50 hours on uh, sometimes I can run more I don't I didn't run as much on this one because of the uh, I'm running my grapple saw a good bit and cutting up a lot of stuff and all but this is the engine of course it's your standard this is a tier 3 6.8 liter uh, John Deere ain't worth a crap uh, we got almost 10,000 hours on it now I had to put a new head on it back during the summer the other head just finally just shot but it's got a lot of blow by coming out the slobber tube right there now and so it ain't gonna be long gonna have to put another engine in it here but uh, should be able to get well over a little over 10,000 hours out of it but uh, as far as service trucks uh, we have two of them this is a f650 with the INT bed on it uh, got a 12,000 pound uh, remote control crane uh, that that uh, we use got a welder on it it's got a hydraulic driven IMT compressor on it also too which is very very handy like it uh, the other one over here is a F550 and it's four wheel drive uh, it does not have a crane and of course the compressor and all uh, we got a hose machine we got all Parker uh, hydraulic stuff both service trucks have uh, hose machines we can make we all of our hoses every hose we make is four wire uh, but we can't make six wire in which a lot of these swing machines like this loader and the uh, uh, processor has a lot of six wire hose on it 6,000 pound hose so we get those made over here in Alabama bolt over there in uh, Tuscaloosa but uh, it takes about it takes about 20 minutes to fuel this thing up here so I usually get down, I, I top off my chain oiler on my, on my grapple saw here. So I'm fixing to put my gloves on and uh, fill it up with oil and get it ready. I try to do this in between trucks. Uh, well, I don't have any trucks. I don't have any trucks right now. So that's what I'm doing. So get her fueled up, ready to run for another week. So we'll see y'all later. See y'all.